My name is Jayas Powell, and I am an assistant professor of economics at Boise State University. I apply quasi-experimental techniques such as natural experiments, instrumental variables, and random discontinuity design to answer policy relevant questions on environment. To use these techniques, I apply large scale census household survey data in conjunction with satellite data. I am interested in answering three primary research questions. First, how do economic agents respond to environmental shocks such as climate change and forest fires? Second, what are the environmental effects of agricultural practices? And finally, how much do we value our natural resources? Let me quickly talk about one of my recent research projects, which involved quantifying environmental externalities from agriculture fertilizer applications. To give you a sense of the data I use in my project, the last row in this table here gives a number of roughly 1.7 million pollution readings that came from over 87,000 water sites comprising of 2,963 counties between 1987 and 2006. To estimate the effect of fertilizer applications on water quality, I modeled concentration of pollutant in a given watershed, W, for a given year, T, as a function of letter Y, which gives us the amount of fertilizer used in the same watershed for that given year. My parameter of interest here is theta, which gives us the percentage change in water quality associated with a percentage change in agricultural fertilizers. I augmented the regression model with vector X, which includes urban runoff with the fluctuations and upstream rainfall shock to account for special spillovers. I also included water shade and reason by year fixed effects. As you can see in the table here, panel A and panel B conclude that increasing nitrogen fertilizer as well as phosphorus fertilizer is contributing to the rise of nitrogen and phosphorus pollutants in our water sites across the entire US. This figure helped me generate this state level map which quantifies the degree of environmental externalities that's attributed to the use of nitrogen and phosphorus fertilizers. If you'd like to talk more about your research ideas, feel free to reach out to me through Twitter or email me directly.